this vehicle was ceramic coated with System X Max um, a year ago. It's still performing really well. I'm gonna spray it down right now, and then I'm gonna blow it off to show you how well this this um, ceramic coating actually performs. Eating right off of this vehicle. I haven't even washed it yet. It's in for an annual ceramic refresh. Um, we have all of our ceramic coatings come in every year to get um, inspected and make sure they're still performing at the peak that they should be. This is a demonstration of how hydrophobic. That was a demonstration on how hydrophobic this um, ceramic coat actually is. That virtually dried the car. Like there's literally no water on these panels at all anymore. It all beads right off. Now we're going to see how this Mustang performs um, when I put it through the same test here. Which is going to determine how good the ceramic coat is or whether or not the ceramic coating was even done to the vehicle. Okay, so this is the Mustang in question of whether or not it got ceramic coated. Um, I believe a customer said he paid somebody 1200 bucks to ceramic coat this vehicle. When I put water on it, it does act like it has some hydrophobic properties, but it doesn't really act like it's ceramic coated. Like, you know, uh, in my other video, I showed you a car that I did a year ago, and it's still really hydrophobic. You know, the water's beating up instantly, blows off really quick with the uh, leaf blower. So these bugs up here on this front bumper if this vehicle is ceramic coated those should come off with ease with a pressure washer so that's test number one we're going to put it through and see how it performs So that's test number one. It failed. There's still bugs all over the front of this thing. Those should come off really easy if there's ceramic coat on this vehicle. Ceramic coat um, is basically like a permanent wax. And these should have came off with no problem if it was ceramic coated. You know, maybe one or two that was really um, embedded in the paint it kind of etched itself there sure maybe those would have stayed but that much should not have stayed on the vehicle at all um now let's see how hydrophobic it is because it's not really performing great to me like this water on the hood should be rolling off the car Displays a little bit of hydrophobic properties, but not how it should be. Let me go grab the leaf blower and we're going to see how it performs when I blow um, the water off. This car should dry itself basically with the leaf blower.
So as you can see, I mean, the water does beat up a little bit. So I mean, it does have some type of hydrophobic property to it. I don't know the quality of the ceramic coat that was put on this vehicle. Um, I know that the products that we use, you know, even a year later, it would be performing way better than this. Um, the customer stated he received no warranty card, no information on what product was put on his vehicle. Um, so it's hard to tell, you know, <clears throat> what's been done to this. I mean, in my professional opinion, it's not a great ceramic coat. Um, you know, it's not a $1,200 ceramic coat, which is what this customer paid for. Um, so yeah, I mean, that's my professional opinion about the ceramic coat that was done on this um, Saline Mustang. Thanks.